So I'm interested in your thoughts if you were travelling in Vietnam. What are your favourite holiday destinations in Vietnam? Is it uh, Ha Long Bay, Hanoi, Sapa, Hue, Hoi An, Da Nang? Is it Da Lat? Is it Nha Trang? Is it Phu Quoc? Or Ho Chi Minh City? So I'd be interested in your comments if you drop them below on where your favourite destinations are in Vietnam. Having travelled to Vietnam since 2014, it is the most amazing place to visit. A lot of history, a lot of great experiences, a lot of things to see and do. The Vietnamese people are trying really hard to improve the tourism and I can see magnificent changes that have occurred over the last 10 years here in Vietnam. There's been so much development and great improvement in the quality of services, certainly the hotel offerings and things like that. This hotel here in Dalat is a, is a prime example of a five-star property that is just outstanding. And, you know, when you compare the prices to Europe or to Australia or to America, absolute value for money in staying at a five-star property here in, in Vietnam. <music>
going across to the island of Vin Pearl where it's kind of like the uh, Vietnam Disneyland Vin Pearl. So they've got an island out there and you can see the big Ferris wheel hopefully on that. And I'll just pan back down along the beach here. Just pan down along, back along the beach. So you can still see there's quite a few people still swimming down here on the beach. Very popular, a lot of Vietnamese come down and go swimming late in the afternoon. Of course the sun is setting towards the west. So you can see over there. And there's a apartment hotel there, the Panorama, which I had originally booked, but it didn't have very good reviews. So I ended up canceling that and came around the corner to the Novotel, which I have stayed at before, but um, that's looking down north to um, up towards there. You can see the Sheraton a little bit further up. Some new properties that have sprung up since I was here last time. And uh, yeah, it's quite, um, quite busy here. A lot of people are holidaying. And uh, gonna go and try a local uh, Vietnamese seafood restaurant tonight. Not too far away, I found on the internet. And we'll go and do some uh, walking around the streets and see what we can see. Maybe have a massage tonight or something like that. But yeah, beautiful spot here in the mid, mid south coast of Vietnam. So you can still see quite a few people swimming down there at the moment. See some islands out there in the distance. Last time I was here in their train, I actually did a boat cruise and we kind of went under the cable car over there and went to some islands down that way from memory. Um, so I don't think I'll do that this time. I think I'll just hang around here on the beach and uh, just soak up. There's some nice exercise facilities down here too, just uh, along here a bit further. Um, there's a the sailing club up a little bit further might go and check that out again but uh, yeah a lot of uh, coconut trees have grown up since I was here last time uh, looks quite good so different weather here tonight um, compared to Dalat Dalat um, has been around 22 24 degrees during the daytime but uh, dropping down to under 10 degrees at night time so uh, really nice today when I got out of the van but uh, yeah, it's good to travel around Vietnam and explore different areas. And good morning, stuff. Vietnam. So many people are down exercising already, swimming in the water. Amazing. Look at that, so many people out exercising. and swimming in the water. Vietnamese people. <laughs> 